Hey, this is Ian for Group Talk Summary for April 16th. Uh, today we talked about trivia, which was an easy excuse to talk about all kinds of things like we normally do anyway, and just call it trivia. Uh, we talked about a lot of interesting things. Everybody, I think, at least had one interesting bit of trivia, like, um, oh, I forgot now, uh, what was there? Oh, we talked about uh, king and queen of some country that I, I haven't heard of. I'm kind of embarrassed about that. Uh, meeting the people every day after Ramadan. So some really interesting things like that. Uh, some words we learned today. The first one is obscure. Obscure basically means not clear or not obvious, something like that. So, uh, for example, my friend is always wearing obscure brand names that I've never heard of. So, like, you know, most people, they have, like, Lacoste or Nike. Everybody knows Nike and Lacoste. But my friend, he shows up, he's like, I'm wearing Fruge. What's, what's Fruge? Who, who knows Fruge? So it's a very obscure brand name. Uh, the story, this story is really obscure. It's really unclear how it ends. The ending is very unclear. It's a very obscure story. Another word we learned is severe or harsh or uh, big, something like this. So example, the tsunami that struck northern Japan was incredibly severe. It will take years to recover. Or she punishes her kids very severely. They will probably have social problems when they are adults. And then uh, another word we learned is controversial, which is a topic, a topic that is kind of delicate. So, you know, people have very strong opinions about this kind of topic and, you know, they'll argue with each other. So, for example, dolphin and whale hunting is a very controversial issue in Japan. Uh, religion and politics can be pretty controversial. So you might not want to talk about those things when meeting somebody for the first time. Okay, and uh, as for mistakes, I'm sorry, I, I forgot to write down any mistakes, um, but there really wasn't a lot of mistakes. Uh, everybody at Group Talk today was uh, very good, very good with the English, and so you you're all did a very good job, and I'll see you at the next Group Talk. So have a good weekend. Bye-bye.